Hi students, hope you are well. In last two sessions, I have taught you two important part of portrait. One is eyes and another one is lips. Using those two component, now I am making a complete portrait of Charlie Chaplin, the king of comedy. So grab your paper and let's get started. We will paint this thing in monochrome in the black color. So you can see I have pencil, I have three brushes that uh, 10 number round synthetic brushes, 8 number round synthetic brushes and 3 number round synthetic brushes. With the black watercolor, you can take poster color as we do, as I don't have black uh, poster color so I take uh, the black watercolor. Uh, this is eraser and the sharpener and one color palette. So, and you have to take a bowl where you can keep water. So, now we will start. First, we will make the cap. First, we will make the hat of Charlie Chaplin. Once it is done, we have to add the to draw the here so these two parts should be similar once it is done with the hair part Now we will start drawing the eyebrow. Once we have done with the eyebrow, left side, and we will do the downside eyebrow. And then we have to. Draw the reflections area too. Once it is done, then we have to draw the another eyes. Oh, sorry, I have forgot to draw the left eyeball. So, left eyeball is also ready. Now we have to do the moustache. Chin. And then we have to cover with this. So it's 
chin is also done. Now you have to show it off. Yes. Now the hair is also appropriate according to the proportion. So now you have to draw the coat. We have to make the line. You can use the scale also, or I just like I use the color palette. So you just need to make a straight line. So you can use color or the color palette or scale. Here we are making the border of the painting. Once you're done with the border, then you have to check your drawing where you have done any mistakes or it's looking good or appropriate. So you have to check it and then you have to erase the measurement line too. Just like the my hat is not appropriate, so I'm just making the hat proper. And then we are just outlining the So we are just building the outlines of eyes and all the features. So once it's done, now we can take the color to paint it. So now this leaves part is also done. We have made take the lines for the measurement of the shading area. That is also done. Here also we have to make some to be drawing so when it is done now we have to color it so just wait and watch how it will look so on the color palette we will use black color because it's a monochrome so only with the black color we have to color it the palette i'm using black color you can use a poster color too. I am using water color. So now we have to first we have to cover with the first we have to do the facial part. So first we will start with the eyebrows. Before you apply the color on the drawing, you should check it on the black part like the coat has a black color so I'm just applying so if the water is more or anything so you can check over here so now it's good so I can apply on the eyebrow now you can see the both the eyebrows is done Again, I am checking over here the color. It's a good bit for applying or not. I am making the nose part even.
you can use this small brush to like three number brush also you can take so you can see that i have made the mustache part now i have to make the leaves So this one is a simple one which you can do at home so that's why I choose this photo to draw or you can do the another one just for the drawing you can take the reference from Google here I am making the eyes now just like the eye drawing we first covered the lines so here also we are covering the line first once it done with the right eye now I will come to To always check that your brush is in water or it's dry if you have a dry brush then don't apply color with the dry brush you have to use a little bit of water so just you have to dip the water line has complete now I will do the eyeball with the small brush I have taken three number brush for the eyeball so just first keep the reflection area open as it is and then cover the rest of the eyeball Keep the reflection area white. And now with this small brush, you can make a thin line for the Down line, you can make a thin line over here. Top one with the dark one, and then if for the lips also, you can do a thin line. Once it is done, we first complete the black part, then we will come to the gray part. So now we have to go to the hat and the pure part. You can take the 8 number or you can take the 10 number brush so this thing will complete fast or you can do it the small brush too which one you are comfortable you can take that now I'm doing the hair part so you can see So you can see that hair is already done. Now we have to do with the hat. So after you finish hat, just you have to feel the color. And just you have to make a line first as the border line. And then you have to color it. 
put the white line gap so to give the 3D effect with the hat and then rest you can color I have kept white as so few space I have kept white for the 3D effect in the hat also and now I will do the coat part so just feel the color where you need to feel black make the outline first once you have done with the outline so now you can see that now I'm covering the coat part you just finish to you just have to finish the black part where you have to make the black color so, so let's see how it will look after completing the black color now we have to cover this part too So you are done with this part to make the line for the tie. So it is almost done. You can see that. Now we have to the, do the grey part. So for making it grey, you can use white or else you can do the light. You have to make black color to take the black color lightly means more water less color once you are done with this you have to just simply apply for the Just give you the 3D feel. Here also you can apply. So almost painting has done. Now just you have to sign your name and just you have to cut the paper according to the border. So hope you like it. Share your reviews with us. Thank you. So now stay home and stay safe and do practicing the whatever I teach you.